go. All right, open. Hmm, this looks new. Make it safe. What is it? Uh, okay, uh, caution. There is a dangerous smell, people. Hold on, what is that? This is disgust. She basically keeps Riley from being poisoned, physically and socially. That is not brightly colored or shaped like a dinosaur. Hold on, guys. It's broccoli! <laughs> yes! Well, I just saved our lives. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You're welcome. Riley, if you don't eat your dinner, you're not gonna get any dessert. Wait, did he just say we couldn't have dessert? That's anger. He cares very deeply about things being fair. So that's how you wanna play it, old man? No dessert? Oh, sure. We'll eat our dinner right after you eat this! Ah! Riley, ah! Riley, here comes an airplane. Ah! Oh, airplane. We got an airplane, everybody. <gasps> Again, my name is Ella and today we're going to be learning about our emotions. Our emotions help us to know how we're feeling and help keep us safe. We'll start by making cards to learn the emotions and how they help us. You're going to start with a piece of paper and the first emotion we're going to be learning about is joy. It's spelled J-O-Y. So I wrote down some of the things that make me feel joy. Going to the beach, spending time with my dog and my family and friends, and doing gymnastics. Joy is a feeling of happiness and it makes us want to smile. The next emotion we're going to talk about is sadness. Sadness is spelled S-A-D-N-E-S-S. -S -S. Sadness sometimes feels like a cloud over our heads. It can make us want to cry or we can feel sadness when our hearts are broken. You may be sad because you lost your stuffed animal or one of your blankets tore. And this could tell us maybe next time we should be more careful and try and keep those things safer. Sadness is a good emotion because it lets us know when we need to change something. The next emotion is one of my favorites. It's excitement. E-X-C-I-T-E-M-E-N-T. -E excitement is when you're super, super ready for something to happen. The person right here is very excited for something about to come. We might be excited about birthday parties or excited to learn and go to school. The next emotion is anger. You may feel angry sometimes at your brother or sister. It can feel like a fire and you might want to yell at someone. Anger is really important because that tells us that maybe we need to talk to somebody. Maybe you need to talk to your mom or your brother or sister about why you're super upset. And that can help us be less angry sometimes and still have the problem get better. The last emotion we are going to learn about is fear. So fear is when you're really scared of something. I'm afraid of spiders because spiders can be dangerous and fear tells us that maybe we should stay away from those and keep us safe. Sometimes you can be scared of the dark. There's lots of things you can be scared of and it helps keep us safe. Those are all the emotions for today. You can pause the video, rewind, and write down all of your own. You can keep these safe and look back at them when you don't really know how you're feeling and see which one you relate to the most. Bye.